What's up guys, it's Molten Marlin, and today I have a very special video for you. It's 5 glitches that have not been patched yet. To start off the glitches, we have a damage boost that can be applied to guns, grenades, melee, whatever you want. And I'm gonna start off by shooting Marcus's dummy, and this will be a base test to see how much the damage actually increases by. And you can clearly see that without the glitch, I'm hitting 413,000. So to start this glitch off, you're going to need Commander Lilith's DLC, and you're going to want to make your way to Doll Abandon. Once you get here, make sure to get a vehicle and follow where I go in the video. When you arrive in this area, make sure to park your vehicle with one wheel in front of that little rock that's sticking out and one behind, and that's how you know you did it right. So to start this off, hop out of your car and enter the gas, then turn around and jump back into your car, and you know you'll do this right if you have the green effects in the corner of your screen. And just to show that this worked, I will be shooting at the dummy again, and as you can clearly see, it is now 1.4 mil, and that is about 3.4 times as much damage as before. I'm assuming that this damage buff works different with all guns, but I'm not 100% positive, and if you don't want the effect anymore, just save and quit. To start off the next glitch, we have a Krieg glitch. Yes, I know, finally some love for him because he has no glitches whatsoever. But anyways, this is a invincibility glitch. And the only thing you will need is a car station and to release the beast. That's about it. So make your way on over to a car station and once you get there, pull out some type of grenade or some way to damage yourself and get yourself to below 33% health and once you get below 33% health quickly use your action skill go into the car station deploy a vehicle teleport to the vehicle you must do that part pretty fast and it could take a few times but it is not that hard to get the hang of so don't worry so now that I did the glitch let's go see if it works and you can see that the spider ants are actually not taking off any of my shield and that's also how you know if you did it right. Quick shout out to me for making a rookie mistake and not being able to kill a slag spider ant in normal mode. Another thing is that you can also use your action skill again if you want to. The glitch won't go away and if you don't want it anymore just save and quit or you could just kill yourself either one. Now this one isn't per se a glitch, but I just happened to put this in here. So all you're going to need for this is a low level Logan's gun, a rocket launcher of some type, and the sham. And I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter what type, but don't quote me on that. And what you're going to want to do is pull out that Logan's gun, shoot at the ground multiple times, and what should happen is actually your sham is absorbing the Logan gun and it counts that as a rocket launcher so you're actually getting rocket launcher ammo from your Logan's gun so it's technically infinite rocket ammo. Yes, here we are with the famous Digistruct Peak rocket jump skip and I chose to do this on Salvador but in reality you can do it on any character but I am only going to show Salvador because I am not good at rocket jumping with any other character and I would recommend watching Jolt's video on it and I will put that link in the description. You heard me right, even Krieg can do the rocket jump glitch. Yes, I know, Krieg's fat ass can actually do this glitch. Anyways, back to the glitch, so start Digistruck Peak, run past all these enemies and just head to the left. And just to let you guys know, I'm going to be rocket jumping with two low level butter booms. So once you reach these big rocks over here, Gunzerk, double grenade jump, and then shoot, and you should land on top of the rock. Now the next part is pretty tricky and it did take me quite a bit of tries to do, but just find the perfect sweet spot to grenade jump and once you do that, just 
double grenade jump and fly across the cavern quick thing to add you'll notice that the binary boss isn't uh, coming out and that is because I am a level 72 and I cannot actually fight the boss because I technically do not have OP levels so that is why and if you wanted to see what I am using here's my gear two butta booms and the rest doesn't really matter and here is my skill tree and the only mandatory one is double your fun which allows you to throw two grenades in gun zerk mode. I will finish up my video with a classic XP glitch that I'm pretty sure everyone that plays Borderlands 2 knows about but I'm just going to show it anyways. If you want to do this glitch make sure you haven't completed rock paper scissors and Marcus gives that out. So bust left right before Marcus is so you're on this dark alleyway. Attempt to jump on the corner of this little pillar right here I kind of fail. Once you jump on that, try to jump onto the light next to it. Then after you jump on that, just jump up again and you'll be out of the map. Once you're out of the map, look towards Marcus's shop, strafe, and attempt to jump onto that little jutting part that's sticking out. And this part can get a bit confusing. Just stay to the right of the vendor and hug the wall. Once you get past the vendor, you're going to, there's going to be an opening. Go to the right again, all the way into the corner. Then look to your left, hug the wall all the way down, and you will reach a little ledge slowly go onto the ledge you can fall off at this point so make sure you slowly go on it and there you are you are where the dummy is to be honest the hardest part of this glitch is actually jumping on top of the dummy and once you're on top of him just start going ham on him you'll get xp but i'm playing in normal mode so i don't get any xp from this because i'm such a higher level than him and another thing is most people use infinity pistols on this quick reminder to everyone gauge usually cannot use these because of anarchy but that's about it for this glitch if you happen to enjoy the video please subscribe to my channel i am desperate for subscribers anyways hope you guys have a good day i'll see you in the next one